This video is not intended as a replacement for the manual for the TBW. It is simply an example of how I use my TBW transmitter and the tuning procedure that I use. First thing we'll do is turn on the primary power. Then we will switch the transmitter to the tune mode. We will set the base range for the tuning with knobs A and C, which will set the band for the transmitter's operation, and knob E, which will set the IPA range. Then we'll set the coarse tuning range on the plate tuning. Next, we'll go ahead and set the loading to 50%. We'll put the mode into CW, then we'll apply AC power. This will bring filaments on in the transmitter, but no DC voltages. We'll check to make sure our filaments at 10 volts. If it isn't, there's a rheostat to adjust that. Now we'll bring the LM on, and we'll spot the master oscillator of the transmitter and zero beat it to make sure it's actually on the frequency we want to operate on. We'll move the antenna to a dummy load. Key the transmitter and peak the, the IPA grid. Then go back and peak the plate of the IPA for maximum grid drive on the PA tube. Return the transmitter back to full power. Key the transmitter and adjust the tuning for a plate current dip and maximum output. In this case, we're using a light bulb for a dummy load. After we receive a resonant dip, we'll go back and hit the uh, output loading and coupling. And I like to adjust them from maximum current out of the transmitter. We'll turn the modulation on on the LM and spot the receiver that's used with the transmitter to make sure it's actually on channel. So this way, when we switch back over to an antenna, we will listen before we transmit. Go to voice mode operation, key the transmitter and check our uh, tuning just once again because there may be some differences between the antenna and the load. And then the transmitter is ready for use. This is Kilo Alpha 3 Echo Kilo Hotel. Kilo Alpha 3 Echo Kilo Hotel. Calling CQAM, CQAM, CQAM. Kilo Alpha 3.